I'm standing in the middle of the Little Shasta River, and what we're looking at is an incredible example of nature at work. What you see here is more than just a pile of sticks and plants and branches. It's actually a beaver dam, which is a leaky wall across the river. And when beavers build structures like this, it holds water back, which creates giant pools. And that's useful because in these pools, water moves more slowly, dirt starts to accumulate in the bottom, bottom. in the dirt plants grow, and when plants grow, bugs grow, and when bugs grow, fish grow. You know, beaver dams and pools like this are places where fish come to get fat, and fat fish are healthy fish. One of the things that's really neat about this is you can see along the back all of this wood piled up. Uh, it's really an incredible amount of wood to see. And this is wood that is moved downstream in the winter in giant flood flows. And when floods move wood downstream, what they're moving downstream are really homes for fish. The wood provides cover from predators like birds. And one of the things that is so incredible about seeing all this around us is it tells us that the Little Shasta River is working the way a healthy river is supposed to work. This stream is in the middle of an active cattle ranch where you know herds of cattle are roaming and grazing and yet this river is still healthy. The reason that's important is it means that there's a future for the environment that includes people with it, includes people in a way where they're maintaining not just their livelihoods, but their heritage. This shows that there is a future for all of us. Okay, I'm gonna go explore.